Hi, good afternoon everybody. This is Jean here. Jean True Love from True Love Quotes for You. Okay, Ma um, Maxwell has a box. <laughs> come, come in Maxwell then. Okay, I asked Maxwell to... Uh, it's a bit big. We didn't have any smaller boxes. We have any smaller Amazon boxes. We've been getting rid of them. No, this is a bit big. It's the only box we have available. Okay. Okay, say hello. Hi. Come say hello, because you're going to be doing the cutting. Okay. Hi, everybody. Good afternoon. This is Jean here with Maxwell. Um, you must excuse our appearance. We just came back from our meeting, and we're all dressed up. I wanted to um, begin the next tutorial of what we're going to be doing. I'm going to be uh, recru recruiting Maxwell um, for some cardboard that is what we are going to be needing okay the very very first thing to make my little um sewing holder here i had used bits of cardboard i need three pieces exactly the same size okay now i'm going to be making this tutorial in many in many videos on um, just a few minutes each the first thing we're going to be doing is i'm going to be cutting my or i'm going to have maxwell cut my um cardboard that's a nice box that is a nice box but it wasn't the box i thought you were going to get i thought we had two other boxes downstairs not this one pack i mean it's a nice box uh, but it's my packing box. E either you want a shoe box, which is not so strong, or you want like those, one of those foldable organic boxes. What's a foldable organic box? Well, it said organic on the box. No, no, I think that it had something organic in it. It wasn't an organic no. box. It, it said organic on it. Okay. And then this, so and you then have to cut. It's just a shame to cut that big box into three pieces. Make, make make multiple of these and sell them again. No, I'm not doing that. I'm just doing one. Or anyway, anyway, do, do, the, the do. point about no, the point about this tutorial is you can make it any size you wish. Now I'm going to be showing Maxwell um, the size that I want that I had used for this little sewing caddy was uh, this is a nine and a half inch ruler that fits in really nice and neatly right there. So uh, we'll be cutting our cardboard at about, I would say about 10 and a half, maybe 11 inches. I can always, I can always um, cut it down or probably 11 inches square for my tutorial here. Why, why not 12? Oh, or you can make it, if you have a 12 and a half inch ruler say, you can make it even bigger. Or if you just wanted a, um, a, a uh, sewing caddy, for, to hold your smaller things. This is this is um, the size that I'm going to be making. So I'm going to try to simplify it. But this is going to end up th this way with the pockets here. And right now I'm just going to show you. Maxwell is going to um, cut my cardboard pieces. And then I will tell you exactly uh, what size to cut for the pockets and everything. Now Maxwell, I wanted you to um, go in my stash and pull out some fabric. That you that we're going to demonstrate on. I thought that would be nice. So either over there uh, or uh, over well, here. Why not? Why not an all blue fabric? Oh, well, go 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 to the all blue, all blue. There's all uh, blue. You really love blue. I can't stand blue. No, I love blue. I love. Blue. Uh, you can't stand blue. <laughs> so go to go to the blue. Uh, There's blue. Oh, that's pink. That's pink. So. Well, I thought you wanted. <laughs> oh, mate, careful. Oh, careful. <laughs> 14,000 things to 14, be happy about. 14,000 things to be happy about. While Maxwell, hold on, is choosing fabric, I'm going to read. Uh, that this one's not copyright. That Maxwell's pink. So? I thought you said blue. Well, Wading knee deep in falling leaves. When the dog brings the paper in and there's not a hole in the middle. Well, we all have a hole in there. We have a hole. <laughs> Buying fresh flowers. <laughs> and oh, that's what you've chosen. Oh, okay. Do you love that? Yeah. That's blue as blue can be, Maxwell. <laughs> I changed my mind. Okay, Maxwell changed his mind. So I need some, I need um do, this do, fabric. Do, do, okay, here. shush, shush. I need this fabric. Shush, shush. Do you love it? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a smaller print. 
or maybe a smaller print. That's a little bit big and obnoxious. Look what I have here. Well, I am big and obnoxious. No, you're not big and obnoxious. I'm, I'm, I'm big and obnoxious. Well, well, you want this one? Well, well, well the thing I'm, that I'm building is big and obnoxious. Why not big and obnoxious? You, you want this one? Okay. Okay. Or do you want something less obnoxious? I, I think I want something a little bit less obnoxious. To be to work with this, it might be a little bit busy, Maxwell B. So, <clears throat> and I thought you wanted blue. <laughs> I, ch I changed my mind. <laughs> Let me read something else to be happy about. The effects of s the smell of musk. Ooh. Mm, I guess I'm very... Musk? Very, very, mm. Long hands. <laughs> Oh, well, well, hey, at least I can re reach higher things than, than you can. Any lucky find, like, like money in a pocket. Oh, getting rid of a headache. Yeah. New cutlery. This is a lovely book. Aw. The Pure Promise of Dawn. How lovely. Focus, mother. Okay, focus. <laughs> um, okay, so this is my next tutorial, which I'm going to get whenever I get to it. All right? So... Maxwell now is going to be cutting. Let me see. Ah, oh, that's pretty. That's pretty. I like that one. And then I'll, I'll choose some coordinating fabrics for the pocket, and I will be telling you the size fabrics to cut and the things we need. But right now, Maxwell, I'm going to put my camera down, and Maxwell's going to be cutting my three pieces of cardboard the size that I want them, which will accommodate this uh, ruler here, which is a nine and a half inch, so probably about 11 inch square uh, pieces that he's going to cut. So we can. Thank you for following, you guys. Yep. And um, Maxwell, I'm going to show Maxwell. Oh, you're left-handed. How to cut my cardboard? I think you showed me how. Yeah, when, but, when, but do we have? We don't really. have left-handed scissors. You, you never have left-handed no, scissors. No, well, you're mean? the only left-handed person <clears throat> in the whole house. Uh, in the whole family. Well, your side of the family, Uncle Don. My, my brother is left-handed. Okay, so Maxwell's going to be cutting my cardboard for me. So that's the first thing you need to do, folks. Yeah, do, do, do. Save an Amazon box. All right, let's go to it, Maxwell. Yes. So, hey everybody, I am back. I have cut my pieces for my little sewing caddy here, okay? And I'm going to go over this very slow. As you know, I do slow and I repeat myself a lot. Um, so even a beginner could make this. So follow along with me. This sewing caddy has three pieces of cardboard. One, two, three. Three pieces of cardboard, which I have actually interfaced the fabric. I've made everything really quite stiff and secure, and I stitch, stitch, stitch very, very, very carefully. If you've ever watched me, I, I um, go back on myself. I back stitch a lot to make my things really, really strong. That's why I'm using a interfacing, which I've done on this uh, holder right here. But the first thing we do is Maxwell cut me his three pieces. I'm using 11 inch cardboard squares. Now, my holder here will be slightly larger than this holder there, which is fine. Absolutely fine. Okay, I'm, I'm doing 11 inch squares. I think that was about cut it 10 inches or so, 10 inch squares, it's a bit smaller, just to fit my nine and a half inch ruler. But I'm making this one um, a little bit easier and a little bit more simplified than that one. But it will end up the same look. Now, you're going to be needing one, two, three, four different fabrics, okay? Um, I've chosen the, the, the main fabric, the first pocket fabric, my second pocket fabric, and my third pocket fabric. They're all four different fabrics, okay? So, for my main fabric, for my project here, I have cut 
two 12 inch by 44 inch the width of fabric that's being generous and you will see how I sew this when I go to sew it that is what I'm calling my main fabric I have also cut two 11 inch by 42 inch iron on facing um, pieces I'm going to be making my outside fabric which is on my holder here this here and this here I'm going to be stiffening it very much that's why I'm using two pieces of iron-on interfacing on each of the um, pieces now I'm making it um, my interfacing just slightly smaller as you can see 12 by 44 11 by 42 just because I don't want a tremendous amount of interfacing in my seams that's all I'm using a fusible iron-on interfacing now I'm coming over to my first pocket my first pocket fabric is you cut one 12 inch by 18 inch piece of fabric okay this is folded this is folded here so it's 12 inches across by 18 and again I'm interfacing this one time I'm cutting a piece 11 inches by 17 inches from my first pocket interfacing okay my second pocket is going to be this brown dot because I'm trying to incorporate the brown and white the pink and white the brown pink and white so my main my first my second pocket I'm cutting my second pocket 12 inches by 13 inches I'm cutting one piece of interfacing 6 inches by 12 inches Hopefully I can, I'm going slow enough that you can write these down. And again, whatever size you want to use, you will, I will explain that. My third little pocket in the front, I'm cutting one 8 inch by 12 inch second, uh, third pocket fabric. And I'm cutting one 4 inch by 11 inch third pocket interfacing. Again, just making it slightly smaller on the seams and I will show you how I do that when I actually construct my holder here so again main fabric first fabric first pocket second pocket third pocket okay so main fabric first pocket second pocket third pocket okay so that is our cutting for right for right now i'm going to finish this video i'm going to be doing this video in parts because i want to i want to show you what my next video is um how i put this together um and how i'm going to be reinforcing the seams and interfacing it so i do hope uh, you've enjoyed this little tutorial with maxwell he was a darling and how we're going to do this again you can make it however big or however small you wish um, and it holds, as you can see, a, a lovely amount of um, tools here. And again, it is um, collapsible. It does collapse on itself. And as somebody else said, this could even be used as like an iPad holder or like even a, 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 a phone if you made it smaller for your lap. But I will go into that when I'm actually constructing it, constructing it. So I hope you've enjoyed. This is pretty fabric that Maxwell chose his second, his second half, um, his second choice. So yeah, I hope you, I hope you're going to follow along and enjoy my tutorial for my little, little sewing cabbie. Okay, thank you very much, everybody. Love from the true loves. See ya. Bye bye. <laughs>